intro. Hey everybody, Coach Mike here. Today I'm going to be taking you through three variations of the dumbbell chest press. I often get asked which is the best variation. Well, today I'm going to show you all three and then discuss. For me, it's really important to make sure that the key here is just the elbow position and the, the movements are done pain free. If your client or you are complaining of pain after these exercises, they're probably not for you. And I'll sort of suggest which version to maybe try. So, the first version we'll look at is the typical pronated grip position. <clears throat> Once we're set up at the top, the idea is that we're gonna come down with the elbows bending slightly forward and the wrist staying stacked over the elbows. Pressing back up nice and strong, feeding together. This is a predominant pec dumbbell chest press exercise um, and it's great for developing extra hypertrophy in the, in the pecs. From here, we've got the neutral grip. With the neutral grip, we bend the elbows closer towards the body, overloading the triceps, and then pressing straight back up, locking out strong. Elbows nice and strong next to the body, press up. And then last, the twisting grip, which is my favorite, is sort of a hybrid of the two. So starting pronated, we twist down into neutral, driving back up, squeezing the pecs hard at the top. Drop down into neutral, press up strong, squeeze together at the top. Throughout each of these exercises, I'm always focusing on the same thing. I'm always trying to make sure I pull my scapulas back, keep the wrists stacked over the elbows at all times, no matter which grip I go with. Again, it's really important to make sure that you're doing this pain free and not causing any unnecessary stress to the shoulder because especially in the pronated grip position, there's a likely high chance of risk of injury. Thanks for watching.